Hey everyone, Chris Meets with Anywhere POD. Today we're gonna to go over how our live preview feature works with Etsy so that you can show your customers a live preview. They can see their personalization options on the product before they purchase on Etsy, which is huge and can really simplify your life, especially for any kind of personalization where you want the customer to be able to upload a file. This allows the customer to upload their image before they purchase see any kind of changes that you have set up to, uh, to perform on that image, whether it's remove the background, crop it to a custom shape, use our AI filters. Customers are gonna be able to see all of that right there in a live preview before they purchase. So no more back and forth with the customer having to send proofs back and forth or dealing with compressed images that come through in Etsy messages or simply a customer just not sending you the, the images that are needed on a listing. This way, your customer is going to be confident in the product before they purchase, be able to see that live preview, completely take the workload off of you, so it makes everybody's life a lot easier. So we're going to walk through a full example today from creating the product all the way through to seeing the live preview on Etsy and what the customer sees and how the fulfillment process works. So to get started, we're going to start with creating the product. We're going to be working on a mom-themed ornament today. We already have our design set up in Canva, so we're gonna be able to import that into Anywhere POD directly without having to rebuild the product or reconfigure anything that we, on the product. So to get started, we're gonna to come to our product catalog and we're gonna come over to ornaments and we're gonna be taking a look at our Printify ornament today, working with this ceramic four shape ornament, although we're just gonna be building the circle ornament for today's example. So we're gonna come into our designer here by going to start designing. And as I said, we already have the design completed in Canva. So when we click on add from Canva here, we're gonna see all of our most recent designs here in Canva right at the top. And we're gonna be able to import our um, mom themed design here. Not only are we gonna be able to import it from Canva, but it's already gonna be set up with the correct layers, the correct text, the correct font, everything already set up for us. Uh, we used frames for the mom portion of this design. Those frames will also import to Anywhere POD, so there's no additional setup needed to be able to uh, have the customer be able to crop their image to those specific shapes and select what portion of their image they want in each shape. Since the fonts that we used here are already in Anywhere POD, all we need to do is mark our text field here as personalized. If we take a look at any of our images, we'll see those are already set up to be personalized and set up to crop to custom shape. So there's no additional work we need to do to set up products like this that use frames inside of Canva. Huge time saver there being able to import all of that information. So we're just gonna do the circle and we're gonna go to create product. And this is gonna generate the artwork for us. It's also gonna automatically create any of the vendor mockups that are available, as well as any custom mockup templates that we already have set up in Anywhere POD. So you can see here our mockups are complete. We even have some custom mockups on here to be able to show it in a couple of different views. So those are ready to go for us without having to, us having to do any additional work. Of course, from here, we can set up our title, description, and tags. We have a great AI tool that will actually take your research data and be able to help generate that information for you. So make sure to check that out. To enable the live preview on this product, all we need to do is come up here to the top, like it says here, and click on enable live preview. Now live previews are completely optional to do personalization on Etsy. And in fact, we only recommend it if you are doing something more than just text. If all you have is text on your design, we still recommend having the customer put that text in the personalization field directly inside of Etsy. You can still show a live preview and have it be optional for the customer if you wish, um, but where this really comes into play is when you're doing uh, file uploads or image collection, clip art type designs. So all we need to do for this product is click on enable live previews, and this is gonna go through and generate the live preview for us, and we'll take a look at that here in just a second. Now that that's done generating, you can see here, uh, we can click on the link here to be able to see a preview of what the live preview section is going to look like. And what we wanna do now is add our um, live preview options and instructions to the personalization instructions so that when we publish this product over to Etsy, it's gonna have the personalization instructions with the live preview link for the customer to be able to see. So we're gonna click on add to instructions here that's gonna give us a list of instructions that we can use. 
Of course, we can edit or modify this any way that we need to. For this design, we don't want to show the uh, variant options inside of the life preview because we only have the one variant option for the customer. Where this option comes in handy is if you are adding multiple variants um, or artwork variations to a product. So if you're doing uh, like grandma's garden themed design where you need the customer to enter the number of names that they want on the product and have the artwork change based on that, you can do that with anywhere POD. In that case, you're going to want to turn on the, uh, the variant options to show inside of the live preview. So while they're doing their preview options, they can select how many names they want to enter. Once that's complete and we have our personalization instructions set up here, we are ready to publish this product over to Etsy. So this is gonna initially create the product in our Etsy drafts. You can make any changes to it you want to in Etsy then, and then publish the product. So let me go show you what that looks like when the customer lands on your page in Etsy. So here's our listing now inside of Etsy. You can see here under the personalization instructions, uh, we give them the information to copy the URL so they can see the live preview here on the product. Now, as they make their changes, they're gonna be able to see those in real time over on the product itself. And as they upload their images, they'll be able to crop to the custom shape that you have set up. So each one will open our image cropper here and they'll be able to adjust the size and position that actually will get cropped and will show up on the product. Once they have all of their personalization complete, they click on next, and then they just need to click on continue on Etsy that will copy the personalization ID where they can just paste it here inside of the personalization field in Etsy. Now, when they place this order and it comes through, we're gonna be able to grab that information, get all of the personalization information that they entered, text, images, any of the clip art or image collections that they have set, and automatically apply that and build the artwork for you. So you can either review and approve it or have it set to automatically go to production since the customer's already seen and approved the draft. If you do ever wanna add your own custom live preview, you can do that as well. So if you wanna match your live preview page to have the same type of mock-up that you have inside of Etsy, you can easily add in your own live previews just by uploading your uh, blank mock-up image and then set up your live preview. So when you come in to edit live previews, you'll see an option here for create new template. That'll walk you through the process of being able to create your own template that's unique to you and your store or your product to match the rest of your store. As you can see, this can be an amazing time saver, not only for you, but also for your customer. Eliminates all of the back and forth, especially when you get into uh, cropping to a custom shape or if you're applying any of our AI filters where you can convert someone's image to watercolors or chibi art or any of that type of stuff right inside of the live preview, it really can take your designs and the listings that you can offer to the next level. We are excited to see what you guys create with it. And as always, if you have any questions, always feel free to reach out to our support. We're more than happy to help out anytime. You can reach us down here in the bottom right by clicking on our little help bubble. We're more than happy to uh, help in any way that we can or answer any questions that you might have. Hope this was helpful and hope you have a great rest of your day.